And Russo Park, Louisiana's Raging Cajuns, with a pivotal 7-6 victory over Tulane's Green Wave, continuing their hopes of getting hot at the right time of the year and possibly getting into postseason play. I'm Dan McDonald, along with Ronnie Rance. And, Ronnie, suddenly the Raging Cajuns are the 27 Yankees. They're hitting the ball <laughs> out of the ballpark. Yeah, the Raging Cajuns 18-7 and seven in their last 25 ball games, But today they went back to circa five years ago when they led the nation in homers. Bourgeois in the second gets a wall scraper, hits off the glove of the left fielder for Tulane, but counts just the same. That was the first home run of the night for the Raging Cajuns. And then after that, it became the Todd Lott Show. In the fifth inning, a little half-swing, excuse me, changeup that he hit out to left field for his second home run of the year and then he follows it up in the eighth with a home run that at the time gave the Raging Cajuns a four run lead seemed insignificant turns out they needed all of it to hang on for that seven six win and how about Todd Lott three homers in his last two games Trevor Jensen gets a three run homer for the green wave in the top of the ninth to cut it to seven to six but Logan Stelke comes on and gets the last three outs he gets a save as you see, the Raging Cages now 30 and 23. Three big games coming up Thursday through Saturday against ULM before the Sun Belt Tournament. So the Cajuns hopefully staying on a roll as they go into the final two weeks of the season. And that's how it was as seen on CST.